I'm Madeline Burke alongside Paul Dettino with your two minute drill and Paul the Giants are headed out to Los Angeles to play the Rams on Sunday. This will be the first time in 26 years the Giants will play a football game in LA. I better check the grays in my hair Madeline because I remember those days in LA when Roman Gabriel was their quarterback. Not that long ago. All right, maybe a little bit. Maybe it's been a few years. But as this Giants team prepares for Sunday's game, head coach Joe Judge has seen the struggles on the offensive line, but he still expresses confidence in center Nick Gates. I think he's making improvement game by game. This guy's made a lot of progress for us, you know, on a daily basis in his communication, his understanding of the position, his studying of opponents. It was a different move at first for Nick going outside to the inside. So he's had to learn that both in a technique standpoint and also just a different way you look at it. You know, when you're the tackle on the edge, you see everything just truly inside out. You know, when you're the center inside, you've got to see both sides peripheral. The mental aspect of playing center is very large. OK, and he's handled that very well for us. Indeed, the Giants rushing attack averaging less than 60 yards a game. And it's Mark Colombo, the offensive line coach, who says those guys are really ticked off. We'll see if they can take out some of that energy on the Rams. Now, this Giants defense is also going to have their work cut out for them as well. They'll be facing a Rams offense that's very balanced against the Bills last week. They ran 32 run plays, 32 pass plays. And Logan Ryan says, hey, you got to be on top of your game to face this offense. I think that they have really good receivers. I think they have a really good scheme. And I think they have good balance where you can't say, oh, this is definitely a run. This is definitely a pass. They line up in the same looks and run different plays out of it. So it makes everyone kind of focus on doing their job because you can't really tell too much what they're going to run before the snap. Well, the Rams are top 10 in the uh, NFL in offense, averaging about 30 points a game. They can put up numbers in a hurry. And don't forget, Robert Woods, their deep threat wide receiver, also has taken handoffs out of the backfield in the running game. Absolutely. And these receivers, we know they can block. We've seen it in the past as well. All right. Well, Wednesday practice update. Jabril Peppers did not practice. As you'll remember, he left Sunday's game with an ankle injury. Julian Love as well was limited. Now the Giants will face the Rams Sunday at 4 p.m. Eastern. For Paul Dettino, I'm Madeline Burke with your two-minute drill.